This is gonna be the first evening sit of the hunt for me. We didn't have time to set up a double tree stand, which I'd prefer that my brother's with me, so it's gonna take a giant for me to wanna to shoot tonight because I would much rather have the experience of him hunting with me. So if I can hold out tonight and uh, put together a double stand for tomorrow, I'd much prefer that, but should be some good um, bear watching anyways. Well, here comes Harvey to come get me with my brother. My little buddy's still here. He's getting nervous. All right guys, we just got to my bait right here. I'm gonna go check the stealth cam. We're gonna reload the bait with some new beaver and oats. Coming a little early today because that big black bear bit, uh, hit this the other day at like, hit it super early. So, since Walker's not out here with me right now, I'm gonna sit it most of the afternoon. on the butt now, dang it. That's all right though, he'll be back. big black bear came in I was looking for. Came right, right out here across these logs, across the creek on those logs. Stood right there by the beaver, broadside. So I shot. And man, he just walked off that way. I hope that's a good shot. It looked like a good shot. I think it went right through him. Yes. Yeah. Man, I really wanted my brother to be with me, but He's not feeling good, so today he's decided to stay at the lodge and go check it out. There's my arrow. I think I hit low. There's some blood. Is it blood? Not a lot. But it's probably in. I heard blood, is, that means it's uh, you That's hear blood? thick. Okay. Yeah, lots of blood. Really good blood trail, guys. That gives yeah. me some confidence. He didn't make any noise. Look at the stuff these things live in. It's all swampy. Back to the lodge, but without that big bear. So bummed right now, so frustrated with myself. Have a chance at a bear like that, the one you're hunting for, and 
blow it. And drove. Long sit. Ooh. Long sit today. Any action? Oh boy, you have no clue. What happened? How far did you track it? Uh, until we ran out of blood. Guys, we're back at the stand. I just checked the stealth camera and guess what? He's back. The big black bear was here at 1.30 today. So uh, like we thought, he was gonna not die from that hit. So it's good. I'm so glad knowing that he's back. I got Walker with me tonight. Another we got stand. doubles tree stands. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're gonna get sitting in a tree and please pray that this bear shows back up tonight. And I can put a better shot on him. Wow guys, <laughs> how awesome was that? Super excited to uh, just know that the bear was alive. And right at about seven o'clock, Walker saw him coming down the exact same pathway that he left last night. So how crazy is that? The last time I saw the bear, I had just shot him and he, he walked off and ran down that trail. The next time I see him, he's coming down the same trail right back to the bait. I was just waiting for a perfect shot um i never got one so last thing i was going to do is go back to the lodge and have to tell the guys that you know i took a really bad angle or i took a moving shot and i wounded him again so that will not happen the next time i shoot him it'll be perfect and it'll put him down but thanks to the stealth camera we know he's here all right guys we're back in the stand big black bear hit the bait at 10 p.m after we left yesterday and he's been in here three times today. So like 6 a.m., 10 a.m., and 1 p.m. And right now it's about 3.15 p.m. So, I mean, he's here every three to four hours, it seems like. So he'll be back within the next few hours. Just fingers crossed that we can get a good shot at him. Are you kidding me? Did that really just happen? Dude, for reals? For reals? Dude, it came back? This is unbelievable. Unless there's like twin bears. That just doesn't happen, guys. I gotta get down and see this bear. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Check that out. The bear. Check it out, Walker. The bears are right there. Straight oh ahead. Gosh, down the yeah. trail. Holy crap. Look at the coat on him. She's got like perfect fur. Oh my gosh. Holy cow, what a great 
shot. Made a great shot on him. He didn't go, what, 50 yards? Yeah, maybe less than that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is a beast. Look at the head and the neck. What a crazy hunt, guys. There's the bear. Got him out. Out in the open here. I'll give you guys a closer look at him. Big old black boar. I thought, or I think, I still don't know 100%, but I thought this was the bear I shot the first day. This one may have a little more brown to his muzzle, which honestly would bum me if it's not. I haven't been able to really flip him over, but if it's the bear I hit, there would have to be some damage under here, and uh, I just can't tell right now, so. Man, I mean, my instincts just said, it's got to be the same bear, same stand, come down the same trail and everything. And now I just don't know. So, uh, kind of bummed, honestly, to be, to tell you the truth, kind of bummed if it is a different bear. I mean, I'm happy I got my first bear, but I'd have much rather had it be the other one. Still, I don't know, but I just have a feeling it may not be. But wow, what a hunt, guys. This has uh, been quite the trip with Walker in this tree stand with me. RL Trout Camp, man. They put on a good hunt. The fishing's been awesome. The bear hunting has been awesome. Everybody has seen bears pretty much, if not, every single night. So, there he is, guys. I honestly don't know what to think right now. I mean, I don't know much about bears, but to me that seems like a big, uh, big boar. He's got big head on him and just, like, no neck. So, I'm stoked. I'm stoked. That was pretty exciting. But man, I, I wish it was the same bear. Untying him. Bear's in the boat, man. That was a lot of work and we weren't even that far from the shore at all. Look how thick that thing is. I mean, his coat yeah. is literally perfect. Had to drug him through some trees. But his coat literally is perfect. Man, I'm stoked, guys. I know going back to camp, everybody's gonna be super happy, so that'll be fun to pull in. Well, things are getting pretty crazy out here. Still gotta have our mosquito net. We still got the mosquito net though, <laughs> so everything's all good. We got rain gear, but uh, we're driving right into a storm. And these waves are dangerous, so we got the flotation device on, and we're just trying to make it back to camp. <laughs> Dude, Eric! Yeah. Look how big that bear is! It has to be Dude! Woo! Yeah! 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 Guys, now that I'm home from the trip and I've had some time to sit down and really look at the trail camera pictures and look at my videos that I collected while I was hunting, it is definitely not the same bear. But the good news is the big black bear with the black muzzle that we called Midnight, he is alive and well. In fact, the craziest part about it is I actually had that bear coming in as well. And he did come in and I didn't take a shot at the time. So it's so crazy, I didn't put it in the video just because it was hard to explain, but check this out side by side. These two bears are different bears and these are within about 20 to 30 minutes. So you can see the bear on the left has the dark black muzzle and the bear on the right has a little bit of brown, which is the bear I took. So just watching these clips and seeing the trail camera pictures give me confidence that that big black bear is gonna be um, healthy and do just fine. In fact, maybe he'll be there next year, who knows. Thanks again for watching this video. We had a great time up at RL Trout Camp. If you guys are interested in uh, booking your own trip, I left a link in the description box below. Mm -hmm.